Hey guys, Steve here with another gear review and today we're going to talk about Denai cooler locks. Now you wouldn't leave $500 sitting in the back of your truck would you when you go to Walmart or Home Depot? So why would you spend hundreds of dollars on a cooler and then just leave in the back of the truck as you go inside a store? I love my Yeti cooler. I invested a lot of money into it and want to keep it safe and make sure it doesn't get stolen and this is where Denai locks comes in as I've actually had this happen to me in the past. Before I got my Denai lock, this is what I used until one day I actually lost my key for it. Then I had to get a pair of cheap bolt collars from like Walmart and I cut it off. Never again. Now what I want to do is take a look at these Denai locks with you guys in just a little bit more detail. So the design of these locks is really is simple. You have this bar that's going to go into the hole which most of the top end coolers nowadays have. Then it simply locks into this little device here that you screw in the back of your truck. ATV, UTV, a boat, a trailer, whatever you might want to install it on. Now the installation wasn't very hard. That's kind of one of the concerning parts I thought about when I first found out about these locks as I was on the market. But it must have taken me less than five minutes to install it. You're simply going to drill a hole, put the bolt through it, and then there's a breakaway nut you're going to put in the underside of it. To lock this lock in, you're basically going to drop this rod through the hole in your Yeti or in RD. I know they make these for multiple different coolers and if you guys have questions about whether it fits yours or not you guys can go ahead and go on their website and check for yourselves. I will leave a link down below in the description. And then this rod is going to basically go into this part you screwed in earlier and then you're going to press this button and the cooler is safe. It's not going to go anywhere until you bring your key and unlock it yourself. So let me show you guys one more time how all this works on the cooler. We're going to take the rod, we're going to slide it through the hole, and it's going to go down into that part that we screwed into the back of the back of the truck earlier. Then as it's in here, we're going to press this button and it's locked. It's that simple. Now you can yank on it all you want, it's not going anywhere. Another benefit I found of Denai locks is not only does it keep my cooler safe from thieves, it also keeps my cooler from bouncing around the back of my truck. As I do a lot of driving down dirt and bumpy roads, it keeps it all nice and secure back here. Just another added benefit. I spent quite a bit of time researching a lock for my cooler and when Denai reached out to me and I spent a couple of weeks and a couple of trips now using their product, I could not have been more thrilled with how well this lock is designed and how well it works. I just took a multiple week trip, fly fishing trip that I just did and I left this thing in the back of parking lots, rivers, on the side of the roads and I never once was worried about my cooler because it really does give me a sense of security. As I did mention earlier, I'm going to leave a link to their website down below in the description. If you guys are interested in Deny Locks, I would highly recommend you go ahead and just check it out for yourselves. Overall, I've been really happy with this product and I would recommend it to anybody. Thank you once again. It was Steve here with another gear review. I'll see you guys next time.